वेलकम बैक टू स्ट्रीमर्स आई एम बैक विद अन अदर सेट ऑफ स्टोरीज एंड द टाइटल ऑफ द स्टोरी इज द विटी वुड पैकर एंड द स्टोरी गोज लाइक दिस वन डे देर वॉज अ टाइगर इन अ फॉरेस्ट एंड ही हैड जस्ट फिनिश्ड ईटिंग अप हिज फूड एंड देर वॉज अ टाइनी बोन विच गॉट स्टक इन बिटवीन हिज टीथ एंड द टाइगर वॉज वेरी डिस्ट्रेस्ड थिंकिंग दैट Oh my god if this bone does not come out does not get out from my mouth i won't be able to eat any more and then he sat down he tried taking that bone out of his mouth but everything failed days passed by and the tiger became weaker and weaker and he was still distressed from the bone that was stuck in his mouth So one day a woodpecker that was sitting in a nearby tree flew and came to the tiger and asked Hey tiger why are you sitting like this with your mouth wide open The tiger simply pointed out towards the bone that was stuck in his mouth The woodpecker devised a plan He told the tiger Okay I will help you out to you know get that bone out of your mouth but then uh, you will have to help me so they both agreed to a plan and the plan was something like this where the tiger will go and pray and bring some prey to eat and the and the tiger will have to share a part of that food with the woodpecker and then the woodpecker flew inside his mouth to take out the bone that was stuck post which the tiger was very happy he went for his hunting job and then he bought a prey and sat down below the same tree and started praying the woodpecker was like hey tiger where is my share the tiger was laughing he was like hey woodpecker do you know i am a wild animal why will i give you my share you should be grateful that i you know did not eat you when you got inside my mouth you must be happy for that you should be grateful to me that i Uh, did not eat you up i would have eaten you up easily because i am a wild animal the woodpecker got frustrated he was like what is this like we both devised a plan i helped him get that bone out of his mouth and then he still like this behaving like this with me this is not acceptable the woodpecker now just waited till the tiger dozed off to sleep after having a heavy meal As soon as the tiger fell asleep, the woodpecker flew down and made him blind by just eating up one of his eyes. Oh my god, what was this? Next, the tiger was crying with pain and he was like, "Why are you so cruel, woodpecker? Why did you take one of my eyes?" The woodpecker was like, "A tiger, I have a sharp beak, you know. You should be grateful." I I could have easily you know uh, eaten up both your eyes and made you totally blind but I was grateful to you you should be grateful to me that uh, I left one of your eyes now you can at least go for your hunting and other things with one of your eyes you should be grateful to me the moral of the story is never take anyone else for granted with this I conclude have a good day bye bye